What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of Truck Talk, brought to you by me, inspired by my man, Chili. Thank you guys for being here today. We're going to do a quick little exercise. I want you to look down at yourself right now. If you're out in town, if you're out working, if you're out of your house doing something, I want you to look down at yourself right now. Okay? You just did it. Do you have a weapon on you? Do you have a gun on you? If the answer is no, you're dead wrong. All right, now, for you guys that are sitting in your house, I want you to look around the room you're in right now. Do you have a weapon accessible in the room that you're in right now in your house? If the answer is no, you're dead wrong. You're failing. See, you guys all think that I'm telling you to, to, to carry a weapon with you on you on your person, on your first line of gear, you think that I'm telling you this because I'm just some freaking crazy redneck and uh, I'm freaking paranoid. No, man. We saw, we see these mass shootings happen over and over and over again. And we all know the police ain't going to stop this crap from happening, man. I want you to think about right now, if you were one of those people that you just look down at yourself and you don't have, you're not armed, you don't have a gun on you, I want you to think about real quick how it would feel right now if someone, some crazy person, some freaking insano person started shooting at you right now. How would that feel? You would be completely helpless, right? I don't care if you're a man or a woman. You should go and get training and you should have a weapon on you, a firearm, not a knife, a firearm on you. When they created firearms, knives became uh, outdated, okay? You should have a firearm on you at all time. Even in your home, you should have a, we a, a firearm accessible in the room that you're in. Y'all think I'm freaking crazy, man, and I hear all your dang excuses, I work a job that won't allow me to carry a gun. You know what I would do if I worked a job that wouldn't allow me to carry a gun? I would find another freaking job, man. I would find somewhere else to work. Shove your excuse up your butt, man. Find somewhere else to work. That's exactly what I would do. I hear all y'all, well, I live in a state where I can't carry a weapon on my on, in my car with me. Look, if, if you... Are you really going to obey that? Are you really going to, you really abide by that? And if you do want to abide by that, go find another state to live in. You must do this. I hear it, man. Your excuses don't mean crap to me. When are you going to start, when are you going to start taking this seriously? When are you going to understand that we are the solution to all these freaking nutso crazy people that go out here and perpetrate all of this violent, heinous, murderous crime against innocent people? You'll, you'll, you'll probably start taking it seriously when it's too late. When you're the one, when you're the one that's being fired upon. And you're going to be sitting there and you're going to be thinking, boy, it would be nice if I had a way to defend myself. How do you defend yourself against a crazy person with a gun? With a gun. That's how you defend yourself. You're going to be thinking, man, it sure would be nice. Then, then your life's probably going to be over. That's when you're going to start taking it seriously. Hopefully you never have to be in that situation. I'm not asking you to carry a gun not it's not just for your own personal protection it's for the freaking protection of people around you man it's our responsibility it's our right it's our duty as freaking good people citizens of this country to be armed and to be trained I'm sick of this crap, man. We see it over and over and over and over again. And how does some dude walk down the street and freaking end up murdering two dozen people? 
Because there's no, nobody there to stop him. And the police ain't gonna the police ain't ain't gonna be there in time. The crap is wrong with y'all, man. There's a dang new shirt I created for you guys. I promise you, you're gonna want one. I promise you, you're gonna want one. I'm not gonna show it here on YouTube because they may freaking take my channel down. I'll attach a link to it in the show notes of this episode. Go check it out if you got anything out of this episode. If not, I don't give a crap. Keep chilly in the dungeon, man. Y'all know the deal. Enough said.